there guys, my name is Coaster Child, YouTube channel, Doncaster Born, but built for theme park news, and welcome to a Coaster Child review from Velocity at Flamingoland in Malton, North Yorkshire. Today we're going to be talking about the Ver Vacoma motorbike launch coaster that opened at the park in 2005, and we're going to be talking about the overall experience, my thoughts on the ride, and also the atmosphere around the ride. Now before we get started, Please like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Please share with your friends, your family, and on social media. And keep getting your questions in for the next Q&A when we release it to celebrate a milestone, a future milestone of 2,000 subscribers. And make sure you keep using the hashtag questions to answer those questions for the Q&A session. And for now guys, let's get into this video. So let's start with some stats and facts about Velocity that you may not know. So for those of you who are coastal lovers and have no idea about this coaster, Velocity is a Vacoma motorbike launch coaster that opened on the 7th, uh, on the 2nd of or July, sorry, uh, 2005. Um, it's hard when you saw it on an American site, it sort of switched the dates around. Um, now, like I said, this is manufactured by Dutch manufacturer Vacoma. Uh, it has a length of 2,109.6 feet, a height of 57 feet, a speed of 54 miles per hour with a hydraulic launch, a capacity of 518 riders per hour. It arranges as a single train with eight cars and range two across in a single row for a total of 16 riders per train. Now, with velocity, I think this is going to this, this is a great coaster. I think it's a good launch coaster. I think personally, I think it's better than Rita, and that's saying something. Uh, but I do believe that Velocity is a better coaster. I think the overall atmosphere around the ride is good. It's not the best themed launch coaster. I'd probably give that to Rita and the likes of Stealth as well. Uh, I think they're better themed than Velocity. However, I think obviously with the recent paint up around Velocity to celebrate the brand new inversion coaster uh, right next to it, the new Ten Looper. I think the Velocity will be a better themed coaster in the near future. I think that Flamingoland will uh, do a full park refurbishment in the future. When they bring in this new coaster and more guests come to the park, I think they will go along the theme drew at some point. Obviously they've got signs of theme work with the likes of Kamali's Rock Work, the area around Mumbo Jumbo, the queue line, especially at the start with the rock entrance to Mumbo Jumbo as well. I think that that's really good, and I think they've got loads of different theming around the park, the Dinostone area of the park, that's brilliant. Uh, so I think the rest of the park is going to get themed up nicely, even more than they are now. But I think the total landscaping around the area and around the ride is very, very good. Now, on ride, I'm not going to lie, the restraints were difficult to get on. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Um, but when you when you're secure, when you're in those restraints and you're secure, you're all right, you feel good. It actually not that bad now as a ride experience it's comfortable in most places but it has a couple of rough areas not gonna lie a um, little bit jolty not gonna lie shake it shake it shake it <laughs> shake it shake it um, yeah it's very shaky in a few places but I do believe that um, they will retrack it in the future it, well some bits just as general maintenance not as a full refurbishment of the ride but like a just a general maintenance part i think they will retrack it in the future and i think if they do i think that vacoma will bring in that new gen track that new vacoma motorbike launch coaster track uh, or the newer generation track shall i say and just fully refurbish that ride um now i think that velocity is a good launch coaster and a good coaster at the park as well it's not better than my favorite coaster at flamingo which is kamali closely followed by mumbo jumbo and then velocity obviously here is the worst ride never mind just the worst coaster uh, <laughs> uh but velocity is in my top three flamingo land coasters obviously that might change with inversion if the, t the new town looping coaster opens and of course if that's very good then obviously you know that'll be in my top three and velocity will be in the top five instead as, as number four uh, or number five depending where the new 10 looper tops uh, but i do believe that velocity is a good coaster i think it's a good coaster for the uk it's a good launch coaster and it's a very unique launch coaster for the uk as well i think they've got this very very different style of launch coaster with the motorbike seating and the arrangement of the seating in the motorbike format as well uh, and i think that the motorbike launch coaster concept is very unique to the country and i think uh, other places that don't have this coaster should be very um will be very jealous about this because um i think that a motorbike launch coaster would be great for other places in the park especially 
you look at the Tron coasters, you look at the mobile style of them, I think that something like that could work at other parks in the world as well that don't have like a motorbike type launch coaster. Look at Booster Bike at Toverland, you know, that's the only one in Netherlands and of course the other ones are in China. So apart from Booster Bike at Toverland and Velocity, the other ones are in China. So, you know, other countries don't have that same privilege to have that coastal type of coaster. Especially something that's about an hour and a half away from me. I'm an hour and a half away from England, so, you know, I've got this... Uh, knack to want to go to from England. Obviously, I can't now because you know coronavirus. But in the future, in the near future, hopefully this year, when the new Tan Looper opens, I want to get out there. I want to do a visit at some point. Now I'm sure from England opens for Halloween, so maybe they'll open it over the summer vacation if the coronavirus calms down. Uh, the new coaster, and then they'll sort of you know bring in uh, the Halloween season as well. So hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll try and get out there as soon as possible to ride the new coaster. Uh, as well as the other trips that I've got planned as well. So fingers crossed it all goes ahead and I'm pretty sure Velocity will be worth a re-ride when I return to Flamingoland in the near future. So thank you very much for watching this Coast Show review for Velocity at Flamingoland in Bolton, North Yorkshire. Please like, comment, subscribe. And for now, guys, my name is Coast Jal. Get on the Coast Life. I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.